Hey, you clever little cupcakes. Uh, today I'm going to be looking at answering a random question that I receive, and hopefully I will be able to give a satisfactory answer. So the question that we're looking at today is, what is the difference between venomous and poisonous? And I think this will be actually easier if we look at what venomous means first. Because venomous means the organism has to inject the toxic substance into you, either through a stinger or a fang. So when we're thinking of an organism that is venomous, you should be thinking of venomous snakes. You know, they got fangs and they're going to bite you. Or it could be spiders because they have fangs and they can inject venom into you. Uh, you can also be thinking of honeybees. Honeybees have stingers and they inject toxic substances into you to cause you harm. So that's, that's venomous. Poisonous is something that you have to ingest. You have to put it in your mouth or rub it on your skin and it gets in through your skin. And in these situations, we're looking at organisms like poison mushrooms or a poisonous frog. This frog isn't venomous. It's not going to bite you and put a uh, toxic substance into you. But if you go ahead and lick the frog or eat the frog, uh, you're going to get very sick. When it comes to touch, uh, it gets a little interesting because something like poison ivy is poisonous not venomous ivy it's poisonous ivy because it secretes an oil and if you get that oil on your skin it goes through your skin to delivers the toxins that way but if you take something like a jellyfish and you touch a jellyfish jellyfish actually have small microscopic stingers called nematocysts and these do inject the toxic substance into you and then again, we look at something along the lines of food poisoning, so bacteria. Those bacteria aren't actually poisonous. It's not the bacteria themselves that are poisonous, but once you've ingested those bacteria, they start producing toxic substances inside of your body. So we do call that food poisoning. Hopefully this was helpful for you, and now you know the difference between something that is poisonous and venomous. Just remember, if it's trying to chase you, to bite you, or sting you, that's something that's venomous. If you chased it down, and you licked it, or ate it, and then you get sick, you probably had an encounter with something that was poisonous. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll be looking forward to seeing you next time.